Kalos, I'm a doctor of acupuncture, and today we'll be doing a short beginner's Tai Chi. What's important to note about Tai Chi is that we consciously want to soften our body. We want to allow smooth flow of blood and lymph through the body so we can prevent stagnation, which leads to pain. With that said, join me in this short beginner flow as we move with the breath. Step your feet hip width apart, feel the ground beneath you, and even if you're wearing shoes, really try to press through all corners of your feet into the floor beneath you. Softening the knees gently, tucking the tail under, softening through the shoulders down without force. Arms are staying heavy by your sides, Imagining as if you have little weights on each of your fingertips. And with the inhale, you start to allow the lift of the arms out to the side, soft bend in the elbows, fingers are soft, palms are soft. Exhaling, softening down, bending the knees a little deeper, releasing the arms back down by your sides. Inhale, expand, lifting up as if someone's lifting your arm so you're not exerting too much force muscularly. And exhaling, softening through the knees, deepening the bend a little as the arms soften back by your sides. And keep going like this a few moments with your breath. Exhaling back down. Each time inhaling as the arms lift and exhaling as the arms release back by your sides. And as far as the bend in the knees, the same principle goes. So as we inhale, we gently lengthen through the knees. And as we exhale, we deepen the bend, but very softly. Be aware of the muscles in your body. Notice if you're gripping with your muscles or if you're able to relax through your legs, through your arms, through your abdomen, your back, softening consciously so as to lose any rigidity and tension in the body with this movement. One more like this. And exhaling down. Now we'll go forward. So the arms float forward. There's still a little bit of space in the armpit. So we're not squeezing the arms tightly by our sides. Inhaling, lifting the arms gently like a wave. Exhaling down, softening through the knees. Inhale, gentle wave of the arms up towards the shoulders. Exhaling down. So the arms lift just up to the shoulder level. And imagine again as if someone is holding the top of your hand and pulling you gently upwards towards the sky. Exhaling down as the arms go down. Inhaling up and lengthening up as if someone's pulling us up towards the sky. Grounding down with each exhale into the feet and lifting up and lengthening towards the sky each time we lift and inhale. Keep flowing like this on your own for the next few breaths. And always being aware whether you're still holding tension in any area of the body, be that the hips or the shoulders or the knees, just notice where there is the sensation of gripping and tension and then send the signals to your body to soften. That's it. And last one like this, lowering the hands back down. That's it. Now we go out to the side and we circle the arms around as if we're hugging a tree in front of us. And as you inhale, your fingers and the palms move further away from each other. And as you exhale, you bring them closer in. So there's this soft circular energy in your arms that you're making with your arms and your torso. 
Inhale expands the circle and the exhale to bring it in tighter. You're inhaling, expanding the energy and exhaling, contracting. Inhaling, expanding and exhaling, contracting. Through time and with this practice, you may start to feel a tingling sensation, a heavy sensation in your palms, your arms, and maybe other parts of the body as well, depending on your sensitivity. So the more you do this practice, the more you'll be in tune with these energetic pathways and you'll be able to feel them with more ease. Inhale expands and exhale brings it in. Just a few more like this on your own. And exhale. Again, notice if your shoulders are tightening up. If at any point you feel like your arms are getting tired, feel free to release and come back to what we're doing. Inhaling and exhaling. And last one like this. And exhaling. Good, inhale, palms face down, and exhale, release. Very good. Now from here, I'll bring my left foot in towards my right. My right hand is gonna be on top, facing down, my left hand facing up, palm facing up. So I bring my left foot in, and I twist my torso to the right, holding an imaginary bowl of energy between my palms. And then here, I take a breath in, I step my left foot out, I bend that left knee, left foot flat, and I bring my hands and my torso to face forward now. My left hand goes forward, my right fingertips press towards my left wrist. We stay, we breathe here, and then my palms go forward, I inhale, exhale, I shift back, my left knee straightens, I inhale, and then I exhale, I push, I inhale, I draw my arms back like a wave as my left leg straightens, right knee bends, and I exhale, and I push, the energy forward with my wrists in extension. Inhaling, shift back, left leg straight. Exhale, left knee bends, shift, push forward. Inhaling back. Exhale, push forward. Notice how the back leg feels. That back leg should be soft. Visualize a bright white light coursing through your body, softening from the inside. Again, really creating an internal environment for that smooth flow of blood and lymph through your body. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. This time, left hand on the bottom, right hand on the top, left leg is forward, right foot steps in, torso to the right, to the left, okay? And so again, you're holding an imaginary bowl of energy between your palms. Now the right foot steps to the side and forward, right knee bends, right hand comes forward, you're looking at your right palm as if there's something in your right hand. And the left hand goes forward, almost like you check your own pulse on the right wrist, holding here for a moment. And then from there, reaching the arms, inhale, shift back, left knee bends, right leg straight, and then exhale, push forward, right knee bends, left leg straight. Inhaling like a wave, leaning back, and exhaling forward. Inhaling and shifting back, exhaling and pushing forward. Inhale, shifting back, exhale, pushing forward. The entire time, you're staying soft in the body. That's it. 
and forward, inhale back, and exhale forward. That's it. Inhale back, exhale forward, and last time like this, inhale back, and exhale forward. Step left foot in, left hand is on top, right hand bottom, and then shift your way forward, both hands press down, feet together, knees bent. Very good. Now let's do the whole sequence all over again from the top. Feet hip width apart. Inhale, arms out, lengthening through the knees. Exhale, soften, knees bent, arms by your side. So just a mini sequence. Inhale, lift. Exhale, soften. Inhale, lift to the side. And exhale, soften. Let's go to the front. Arms float up. Inhale. And exhale, soften. Inhale. And exhale, soften. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale down, circling the arms around, hugging the chi ball. Inhale and exhale. Inhale, open. Exhale, fingers come closer. Inhale, expand the imaginary chi ball. Exhale, contract it. That's it again. Inhale and exhale. Inhale. And exhale. One more time. Inhale. And exhale. Very good. Palms forward and facing down. Release the arms down and by your sides. Immediately begin. Right hand on top, left hand on the bottom, left foot in, left knee bent. Okay, so the feet are together and the torso shifts to the right. Take a deep breath in, prepare. Now, left foot steps forward and to the side, left knee bends, torso arms shift forward, left hand forward, soft wrist, soft palm. Right hand pushes forward so your three fingertips are almost touching the wrist and the pulse. From here, palms come forward, inhale, shift back, left leg straight, right knee bent, exhale, push forward, inhale, shift back, exhale, push forward, inhale, shift back, soft body, exhale, shift forward, again, inhale, shift back, Exhale, shift forward, last one, inhale, and exhale, very good. Left hand on top, right hand on the bottom, right foot steps in, torso over to the left. Hold here, hold the chi ball between your hands. Take a breath in, prepare, and exhale, shift, right foot to the side and forward, right knee bends. Right hand in front, left fingertips on the wrist as if you're feeling the pulse. Hold here for a moment, breathe, and prepare. Palms face down. Inhale, shift the way back, right leg straight, left knee bends. Exhale, push, arms forward, wave. Inhale, shift. Exhale, push. Inhale, shift. Exhale, push. Inhale, shift back. Exhale, push. You're in this present moment, the entire practice. You're focused on your breathing and the movement that you're making. Feeling the internal forces, the more subtle forces within the body. So you're being extremely focused and fully in this present moment. Good. And 
One more time, right hand on top, left hand bottom. Left foot in and twist to the right. This time, both hands back by your sides, feet together, push, palms down. Very good. And we shake it out, shake it out, step back, and we'll close with three breaths, collecting the chi. Arms go out slightly and forward at a 45 degree angle. Palms face forward as you inhale, lift the arms up. As you exhale, palms face in and slowly push the hands down. Good. Two more times. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Very good. Both feet in. One hand over the belly. The other hand on top. See which one feels more naturally. We'll do nine circles over the abdomen to one side from the left lower quadrant of the abdomen up transversely and down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and reverse going in the direction of the large intestine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Very good. Palms over the lower abdomen. Hold and breathe here. Feeling yourself grounded and rooting through the feet. Feeling your connection to the earth beneath you. Feeling this centeredness and ease in the body. And with steady practice, you can definitely feel the benefits of this practice on your nervous system as well as on your physical body. I hope you enjoyed this mini beginner Tai Chi. Have a lovely day.